Fifty-three years ago, Jorge Guerra and his young family turned a humble spot on East 7th Street into El Azteca Restaurant. We opened at 3 p.m. May 10th, 1963, Jorge, now 84, says. I have the record, $17.53 in sales. Before the end of the year, alas, El Azteca is expected to close after decades of serving Mexicana steak, chicken mole, soft tacos, menudo, and barbacoa de cabeza. It's a victim of family health care costs, rising property taxes, and a drop in sales during two years of street work on East 7th. Guerra, an outspoken military veteran, has tangled with local leaders for years over questions of parking, crime, and flooding. Now, he says, taxes are killing the place. They kept saying, we want more money, and it's the same buildings, the same land. But it's not our property anymore. As much as I love our community, the business is not a business for us now. His parents raised their seven children in Montemorelos, a small city one hour's drive from Monterrey and Nueva Leon. His mother found herself widowed at an early age, and her son received a basic education before crossing the Rio Grande with a visa on November 23, 1953. He married Nympha Galvan Reña in 1955. They had two boys and two girls. The couple bought a modest house just a few blocks to the northwest across Boggy Creek a year after opening El Azteca. I don't know how the name came to me. It is a name to be honored and respected, he says. Two things the Guerra Enterprise got an extra kick from, community and authenticity. We served more than just enchiladas, tacos, and beans, he says. Cabrito wasn't available in any other place in Austin. We had to bring in our own produce from San Antonio as well as our Mexican beer. One other memorable item for sale, calendars decorated with extravagant images of Aztecs. One day, Nympha Guerra, who had developed diabetes, sat down and stared off into the distance. Something's wrong with you, her husband said. She never recovered, lost much of her memory. My wife had to go into rehabilitation, Jorge says. My life has been there with my wife for so long. My soul will be there as long as I have a soul. This is Michael Barnes.